Uh, my name is Susan, and I'm a stay-at-home mom. I was diagnosed with migraine about 17 years ago, thanks to um, the mother of a friend of my daughter's, who was a migraine sufferer. And she gave me her doctor's information, and I went to go see him and, and actually got diagnosed with um, what he termed sinus migraines. I had one migraine that landed me in the ER because it was just, I'd had it for days, but then it just really changed and it was scary. Um, but they did t do a CAT scan, so I was able to find out that there wasn't a brain tumor or anything. You know, the weight was slowly creeping up and, and I can look back now at my migraine journal that I kept and my weight definitely increased as the migraines increased each month. And then you add one year to the next of that and um, I still have a, a good amount of weight to lose but I'm, I'm halfway there and that's that's huge. Even during my worst days I really tried my best to at least go out and, and just stroll if that's what it took. The big thing and I think everybody says this a lot but it's it's hard for people to understand it's not just a headache and I think think that people, if you've not ever had a migraine, you won't ever totally understand that it's a full body experience, not just a headache.